mistake at now here in this video we are going to solve a differential equation using solvable copy method so let's get started problem x p square solve x p square plus y minus y equal to p minus y equals to zero solution given differential equation x p square plus y minus x into p minus y equals to zero which is quadratic in p right so let's consider quadratic equation in p a p square plus b p plus c by comparing these two equations we'll get a equals to x b equals to equation of p y minus x and c equals to minus x. sorry minus y okay so from this we we'll have quadratic formula p equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac by 2a now consider quadratic formula and substitute abc values This is equals to minus b, that is minus of y minus x plus or minus square root of b square y minus x whole square minus 4 a into c by 2 a. Then this becomes minus y plus x plus or minus square root of x plus y minus x whole square which is y square plus x square minus 2 x y minus into minus plus 4 x y by 2 x this becomes minus y plus x plus or minus square root of y square plus x square 4xy plus 4xy minus 2xy is plus 2xy by 2x then p equals to minus y plus x plus or minus square root of a square plus b square plus 2ab is a plus b whole square okay by 2x so here we are having square root of y plus x whole square we know that square root of a is a power 1 by 2 then this expression can be written as y plus x whole square to the power 1 by 2 and also we know that a power m into whole power n okay a power m whole power n is a power m into n, then you can write this as y plus x power 2 into 1 by 2. Here 2 gets cancelled. This is equals to y plus x power 1, which is equal to y plus x. Right? So you can replace this by y plus x. So this equals to Then p equals to minus y plus x plus or minus y plus x by 2x. Okay. So from this we will get p equals to minus y plus x plus y plus x by 2x and p equals to minus y plus x minus of y plus x by 2x since we are having plus or minus plus right fine so consider the first one you will get minus y plus x plus y plus x by 2x here minus y plus y gets cancelled this equals to x plus x 2x by 2x again 2 
2x plus gets cancelled, which is equal to 1. Okay, so we got p equals to 1. Fine. Now consider the second one. p equals to minus y plus x minus y minus e plus minus x by 2x. Here plus x and minus x gets cancelled. Then p equals to minus y minus y is minus 2y by minus, sorry, plus 2x, which is equals to 2 gets cancelled, so I get minus y by x. Okay? So now we are having p equals to 1 and p equals to minus y by x. So let's find solution for p equals to 1. Consider p equals to 1. Now put p equals to dy by dx. Then dy by dx equals to 1. Then dy equals to dx. Now perform integration. Integral dy equals to integral dx. Then integral dy is y equals to integral dx is x plus integral constant c. From this we'll get y minus x minus c equals to 0, which is solution for p equals to 1. y minus x minus c equals to 0. Now consider second one. p equals to minus y by x. Now put p equals dy by dx. Then you will get dy by dx equals to minus y by x. Then 1 by y into dy equals to minus 1 by x into dx. Now perform integration since variables are separable. Integral 1 by y into dy equals to minus integral 1 by x into dx. Then integral 1 by y dy is log y equals to minus integral 1 by x is log x. Since both the terms having log, so we'll take constant as log c. Then log y equals to, you can write, rewrite RHS as log c minus log x. Since we know that log a minus log b is equals to log a by b. Then you can write this as log y equals to log c by x. And also we know that if log a equals to log b, then a equals to b. So from this we'll get y equals to c by x, then x into y equals to c. From this we'll get x, y minus c equals to 0, which is solution for the second one. Okay? Solution to this equation. So the combined form of these two equations form the required solution. The combined form of these two solutions, not equations, will form the required solution for the given differential equation. Therefore, y minus x minus c into x y or y x minus c equals to 0 is the required solution. So this completes the problem. We have seen our problem from Songbill for P in this video. Hope you'll understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.